guys welcome to tech space on xdn ghana so today i'm going to show you how to install windows on your macbook machine specifically is windows 11 on macbook pro m1 and m2 you know m1 and m2 they use the arm so there is no boot camp currently and on the newer versions of the macbook pros there is no boot camp so Microsoft has released an official version of the Windows software which is Windows 11 that you can install and run on the MacBook perfectly and you can do that using softwares like Parallel Desktop. So today our focus is on Parallel Desktop 18 and guys for whatever tutorial I'm doing today I'm going to show you how to do it for free. You will install Parallel Desktop for free and also you will do your Windows uh, software for free so as you can see i'm running windows 11 uh concurrently with my mac operating system and yes i was also able to install the tally software which is an accounting software on this so um, if you are looking for a way to install your tally on your macbook pro you can go through the steps and also um, install it so uh kindly subscribe to this channel hit the notification bell icon to receive alerts whenever we post also share this channel to uh whomever you know because i'm going to show you the easiest steps so you have a download link and make sure you download what um, um the software then you follow the simple steps that i'm going to lay down this is very brief i had to re record this um, um video because in the previous one i was seeing the exact words but i'm just going to omit it from this okay so definitely everything that we are going to do here is free you are going to download the parallel desktop 18 and install it for free you wouldn't have to pay any subscription similarly you are going to install the windows 11 and use it i'll show you all the ways to do the bypass and what have you If you have any issues you can just send a message in the comment box or you can just look us out on our media handles and social media handles that's uh, instagram on tiktok and you can send us a message right there we are going to help you install this so yes you are going to download the software and the software contains parallel desktop 18.0.1 uh, there's a current version of 18.1 or 18.2 that one when you install sometimes you have issues so just download this and install this okay so you have that one and you have the other folder there the first what you're supposed to do okay is to install the parallel desktop 18 so you double click on it to install So mind you the steps are very simple to follow okay so you are just going to double click the parallel desktop application to install and mind you um to be on the safer side you can turn your wi-fi off okay or pull out any internet connection from your machine and do the install okay so you open this folder all right you have some files in there then you go to the readme okay there's a code in the readme that you have to copy it's very simple so you copy that code okay yes so you copy this code then you close the folder again uh, mind you if you don't have command line tools installed install it before you do this or you can just do it if you face errors then you go and install it so you click the folder you right click then you go to new terminal tab at folder so you are going to open terminal at folder and you can um, click or press ls which lists the files in the folder for you to see okay so i'll just um click the ls and it shows the files in the folder and then now you can paste the code that you copied okay so this is actually going to do the bypass 
so you copy um the you copy and paste the code from the pdf to the terminal all right but before you hit enter make sure that you've given full access full disk access to terminal okay make sure you've given full disk access to terminal so you go to uh the apple icon go to system settings then you go to privacy and security and you navigate to full disk access and make sure that terminal is turned on at full disk access so it means terminal has full disk access and now you can proceed by going back to the terminal and you hit enter this is just going to do the bypass for you all right but in this video i'm not hitting enter because i've already gone through this process so once you are done with this that's all you then close all the applications you restart your macbook you can either shut it down and um, on it again so you just restart your macbook and once uh, your machine has rebooted you can just go on and click parallel desktop now you find out that parallel desktop wouldn't need you to register or use any free trial the parallel desktop business edition is for you for free and you make sure that you um, give firewall okay you make sure that you give firewall to most of the parallel desktop domains so that your toolbox doesn't update itself so you have to know that you are not supposed to update the parallel desktop in order to continue using it for free so mind you on that one so now you are going to shut off the machine then you go you go on to the process now one interesting thing is that the windows software automatically downloads through the parallel desktop so you hit a pin that's going to show you how to install it in the simplest way you just need your internet connection at that time and it's going to install windows 11 the arm version for you and once it's done that's all you have a working windows 11 synchronized with your mac operating system on your macbook pro m1 or m2 you can use it and if you hit any issues you can always remember to go to our social media pages that's sdn ghana on tiktok or on facebook or on instagram you send us a message we are going to attend to you we will help you to install this so guys that's all Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Thank you.